I think I might have a little bit of a uh, traffic jam problem. Why don't they ever use this side? This side, well, I assume cars are going up that side. I've never seen a car go up that side. Or down that side, for that matter. Oh, actually, I have. No, that's the way the emergency services go, isn't it? That's the emergency service way. Okay, well, why isn't it marked then? You could use it. There's no emergencies currently happening. No emergencies happening, right? Oh, God. Hang on a second. Give me five minutes and we'll work out if there is going to be one. Okay, so what am I doing today? Ex not extend the kitchen. We did that last time. Um, see, sometimes between episodes, I have like a week of not recording and I forget everything. Between yesterday's episode and now, all I did was went pee. And now I've completely forgotten literally everything. That's what it, that's what, never mind. Never mind, I remember what I was doing. It was this. I just sold uh, my shares because... Uh, yes, I was paying off my bank loan. Okay, that was why I was doing it. Because to sell a share costs 73000 To buy a share is 88000 So that's like 15000 or whatever. Uh, but the... That's like 15000 and that's going to be pretty consistent because I don't think this is going to go up. Uh, so to buy them back is going to be... More money than... Hang on. Yeah, no, I'm right. Yeah, no, because that's like an extra 15000 between those two. So that's twice. That's about 30000 Uh, whereas I had like, what, 100k loan? Which is like 5000 So yeah, it's, if... If this is going to take me more than six days to pay back, I did the right thing. I'm sure I could just put the loan up and down. Hang on, 45, 4, 4, 8. And look at me, I'm a rich man! And then take it all away again. There's no cost to do that, is there? 45, 4, 4, 8. Very nice. Um... Yes, we were trying to... Uh, sorry, I, I was staring at numbers for a second then. Um, what is this? This is the power we're doing. I assume it's going to take more than six days to make 88... 160,000 to buy back all these shares. Unless we tank the place, we could set fire to it or something. How do we work this number out soon? Fuck it. Should we have a look at the mathematics? 300,000. So that's... Okay, that, that's pretty almost... A few over, but that is uh, 600,000. Uh, there's 700,000. There's 780. So what's this doing? Oh, it's getting taken off by there. So the, all the little bits that go over, minus the 50, and then rounded up 780. I see ya. I see ya now. Uh, so if I sell the shares, how do I work out that sale price of 73,000? What does it say? Um... Oh, yeah. So, okay, that's explaining the thing. Oh, there it is. Like, valuation. Total prison value, 780,000. Uh, minus cash reserves. Oh, they take the cash out. Why do they do that? Oh, because I'm selling shares in the business? Hang on. Sorry. Let me get my head around this so I just understand it. To work out the prison value, they have this value here. This is the prison value. 780,000. Right. Yes. We understand that. Yes. The cash value makes up part of that. Okay. Okay. Part of that number is the cash value. That went up. I mean, that didn't go up because it's rounded. But that would have gone up if it had gone up by 10 grand or whatever. So that is part of that. When you're selling it, it ah, it, it takes your cash value off because that's your money. That's not business money. That's your money. So where you're selling your shares, you're only selling shares of the prisoner capacity, staff, stock materials, fixtures, and fittings, bricks, and more. Now I understand it. Whereas um, buying a share, is, it goes the same way. Oh, that's... Total prison value minus cash reserves. Well, yeah, but then why is that up? I, I see, I see that number just varies in some way. I don't know, though. I don't know, though. Uh, but, of course, if I had a... So, if I sell a share... Sorry, I'm working out how the shares work. <laughs> if I... Because I've got to pay these fucking things back. If I sell a share... That's a, oh, it's, oh, I'll lose 15 grand. Yeah, I won't do that. But if I can sell a share, then the prison value will stay the same. No, the share value will stay the same. The prison value should go up. Because I'll have more cash. But the share value will stay the same because it takes my cash away. Okay, I'm going to risk this. I just want to... I want to... No, fuck, I don't. I just want to know if I'm right. I want to see if I've worked it. Fuck it. Yeah, okay, there we go. So the prison value is worth more, but because it's taking my cash away... The, uh, the thing he's got up. So now if I buy this share back, uh, I would have lost 15,000. Uh, because it minuses my cash away. Yes. If it minuses my cash away... Hang on. Sorry, I'm trying to work out how, uh, loans play into this as well. 
Did loans actually just get taken off? So if I've got a 100k loan, does that take the 100k? Ah, oh, okay, so the 100k gets taken off of the... Well, it's still 850. Loves 200. I suppose it was 850 before. Why is that still worth the same if I've got £200,000 in loans? Is the £200,000 in loan because I've got the cash? That's my loans. So the shares are still worth the same. Yeah. Yeah. No? Yeah. 63? What the fuck was it? Hang on. Let's take that back off. There we go. So it's 50, 60... Well, that's completely different fucking numbers. Hang on a minute. Sorry, fuck. I'm gonna write things down. I'm gonna write things down. So it's some share, 72, 73, we'll call that round it up. And then buying a share, 87. So selling, buying is 87. Because that's the thingy. So it works out the number. Yeah, this works out your number here, 850,000. Because I've sold, I've now got 70% lost of my shares. But I've got 100,000. Because uh, I'm gonna spend this episode. I don't actually mind selling the shares, because it's, it's no point. I'm not going on to another prison. I mean, the only negative thing about this is when you sell the prison is a thing. I might as well just sell all my shares. I could sell all my shares. Or do I want to sell my shares? Fuck it! Let's expand this motherfucking prison! Woo! Because it doesn't each share's like worth the same amount. Boom. Every time I sell it. So there we go. Two hundred and sixty-nine thousand pounds! Oh, it's, it's valued at a million now. Bloody hell. But it's still the same to buy it back, because it just takes my cash away. So, I had... That's less! That's less than I just sold it for! Why is that less? So... Sorry, I'm now... Because now I've got a maximum loan. So if I sell the loan off... 75,000 in loan. But now if I sell my shares off, it's now worth more. So now I increase the loan and buy the shares back. Oh! Oh, what have I stumbled onto here? Okay. Increase the loan. Have you noticed what's ticking down here? What's changing? I own 100% of my prison with no loan. I found an exploit. Uh, that's, yeah, that's a fuck up. Uh, I don't know if that's that's been around for a while or if that's been patched in uh, recently. But holy shit, that's big. That I've got 50,000, I've got 100% of my prison. I haven't fucked up anywhere else. I know I've definitely got the grant. Yeah. Neat. Oh my god. You've all learned a valuable lesson here. Pay attention to your tax forms because you could be wasting a load of money. <laughs> right. What's happening? Sorry, it's, it's working out that the um, the prison value minus the cash reserves works out how much this is. So if I sell this section off, it doesn't change. It varies a little, but it doesn't change because I'm getting the money as cash. So imagine two separate entities. There's the, the prison as a, a value, and then there's my cash money. By selling shares, I'm increasing my cash money, but that's also increasing the prison value. Okay, so they're both going up. Uh, when it's actually come to time to sell my shares, the numbers, they all even up. However, if I go to bank loans and get a bank loan and bring myself a big, big bank loan, what I've done there is I have cashed in and I've got a lot more money. So I, me is holding a lot more money. The valuation goes down. Sorry, the valuation doesn't change. It stays where it is. The 1.15 million. Because the number it's working out, this number here, my cash, has this loan on it. So it's just this minus this. That number evens out. However, when I go to buy a share, that number ignores the loan. That number doesn't see the loan. That just takes away my cash reserves. It, it should say minus cash reserves... And uh, plus loan, because it's a minus number. So that should be including the loan there. And that will keep the value in the same place it is. And then, yeah, that needs mathing. There's a big maths problem there. So I can now decrease this. Get all the money back. Get all the money back. 
And then we got more money. So we sell the shares. So I now own 50%. Should we go for it all together? Right, I've, I've sold... I own 100% of the prison. I've sold half of it for $73,000 per 10%. So I've sold all that. There. This, is, this has become a fucking math lesson. Uh, so what that's done is the prison value has stayed the same. Oh, no, the prison value has increased slightly, sorry, because I have got more money, and they include that in the valuation. However, when it comes to the shares, because you're not selling shares in your own money, it takes your own money away before it works out the value. That's an absolutely fine thing to do. Then I get a bank loan. Now, that bank loan increases my cash, which is sort of its own separate entity, which doesn't really affect... It doesn't change the value of the prison. The prison stays the same value because as much as I've got £250,000 more, it's working out that it needs to take off £250,000 less. So that number stays the same. However, in the equation to buy and sell shares, it doesn't factor in loans. See, it says there... Uh, oh, well, here. Where here was... Total prison value, 1.23 million, yes. Minus the cash reserves of how much cash that I've got. So that brings it to a smaller number. The bigger cash that I have, the smaller that number's going to be. So it brings it to a smaller... It's worth less. See, look, now the prison's only worth, look, 48 to sell and 50,000. Because it's ignoring the loan. It's, it's, it, it's including the loan that I've got. It's ignoring my debt. That's what it's ignoring. That's what it's ignoring. It's the debt. The loan is in there. And now it's worth more. Because I don't... Because I've got, like... But it got more money. Don't have a loan. It's ignoring the loan. So I've got £204,000. So one more time, for those of you at the back, sell the shares. Increases the value of our prison. Uh, and it means that I've just... Because I've got a bit more cash in my back pocket. That's the only reason that's increasing, because I've got a lot more cash in my back pocket. I now get myself out a nice, big, tasty loan. Now, that is not increasing the valuation, because as much as I've got more cash in my back pocket, I owe it back. Now, if we go to buy shares, the equation that's used to work out how much a share is worth doesn't include my own personal debt. So I can now buy shares. All that needs to do is it needs to include uh, debt. That's all it needs to do. So I can now buy shares back, I own more of the prison, and I've made a nice bit of bank in the process. So we decrease the loan, just pay all that jazz off, and we've got an extra 80,000. I think I'm getting like 80,000 for doing that. <laughs> I guess I'm the whole episode doing this. This is this is cheating. Is this cheating? Can we just pretend that I'm just like doing some sort of like fucking insider trading bullshit? I'll fuck this up at some point and lose loads of money. But until then. So that's 280 and now we're on 360. Yeah, getting about 80 grand every time we do it. Which would be the value of... Hang on, so why am I getting 80 grand? Should we work out why it's 80,000? Well, that's the value of a share, isn't it? It's the value of buying a share. Well, it's somewhere between the two. It's sort of the average price between the two. I don't know why that one's higher and that one's lower. They don't seem to be... They're not showing their full working in that valuation thing. See, they're, they're both the same, but that one's higher. So they're not saying, all oh, this is higher because it's a... It's just worth more. But they, they haven't taken into account the debt in that equation. And that's why it's worth more. Uh, so we've got £360,000 to play with and infinite money. Uh, where do we go from here? Uh, I guess I want to buy all that land over there. Yay! <laughs> and uh, I'll buy all that land over there as well. Yay! Oh. Yay! <laughs> oh, gazpacho, gazpacho, gazpacho. So that is beautiful. Um... Right, uh, we'll probably need... Shit, that's, uh, yeah, garbage and all that delivery area. That's kind of small fry. We could probably do... I think the first thing I'd like to do is just to build a big fence all the way around everything. That's what I'd quite like. Just a big fence. We'll have a road gate there, and we'll get ourselves a nice fence. So, yeah, I... Cheating? Perhaps. You know, perhaps that's... Oh, do we want that to carry on and be more garbagey? Fuck it, yeah. Technically, it's cheating, but I feel like because I worked out the math of why it was cheating, I, it's okay with it. That's how that's how bankers get away with it, anyway. <laughs> insider trading in prison architect. Uh, it's not insider trading at all, but, uh, but you know, it's close enough. But who gives a toss? And now I've got only a hundred and ninety-seven thousand. Ugh, ugh. However, will I get more money? God, nobody knows. So money's no longer an issue. Um. 
I wonder if we can actually do anything because money is no longer an issue. Well, we can actually, I'll tell you what we can start by doing. I think we should have done a while ago. Let's give everyone books. Let's give everyone a nice bit of literacy. I dragged that down there. That's good. Books, 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 books. And then books, 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 books. All the way down to you. And then books, 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 books. It'd be nice to give them all bookshelves. Something I've been waiting on for a little while was the bookshelves. <laughs> oh man, I'm so glad I checked that today. I just, I, I, because I, I was, when I was, I, literally, I was taking a piss and I thought, have I done that the wrong way around? I've got to work that math out because I feel, I, like, I wasn't entirely sure I'd done it the right way around. And now I'm definitely sure that I did it the wrong way around, but who gives a fuck? Um, who gives a fuck because I found a secret. The game needs to have a bit of a patch there. Uh, so, no, you never know, by the end of the series, this patch might exist. Uh, but we'll see. We'll see. Uh, is that a thing? Is that already a thing? Ah, fuck it, I'll look it up. I bet it is. Oh, I hope it's not. I hope I just found something cool. I bet it is, though. I bet it already exists. Everything's been fucking found. That's uh, that's my problem with like the entire internet, is that any time it's like, hey, here's a cool thing, it's like, nah, I already found it. I already found it. It already exists, mate. <sighs> Bloody hell. Right, I hope everybody understood what was going on there. Not counting the debt. Marvelous. What a what? A, it's it's easy to fix. It's minus one fucking variable, but uh, gonna sell shares again. So this is also valuing up the prison, so next time I'll get a shite ton of money. Increase the loans, you ignore my debt. And then buy the shares back for less money. And then pay the loan off. Glorious. Actually, thinking about it, the more mon the prison, the more money I have, the more the prison will be worth. So actually spending money, I should actually do this a lot and then spend all the money. I'll tell you what, I'll do that in between episodes. In between episodes, we'll do that. This, however, is forever. <laughs> this is forever away. Oh, what's this? Who are you? Oh, it's Snowflake. <laughs> I thought there were fucking bunnies or something running across. I was like, oh my god, everybody's going to get a pet rabbit. It's going to be beautiful. No. Uh, right, well, now money's not really an issue. We're going to have another ten workmen. Oh, shit, I said ten. And your friend. What's that? It's a notebook page. Maybe it's staff. Nice. Very nice little notebook, that. I'd love to release notebooks for my games, but uh, they're illegible. Uh, oh, we're waiting for funds. Mm. It's a waste, isn't it? Uh, and I'm going to have another just five guards. And I'm going to have another two dog handlers as well. There we go. Because uh, this is an unnecessary number. How much money are we getting in? It really doesn't fucking matter at this point. What really matters is that I have broken it. I've broken it. Cheated. How they like released the final version of this though? It's like they they said they were done with it. Well, I think they've got like people working on it still, but it's not like they're they're working on something else. Oh shit! This menu here says they're working on something else. Yeah, they're working on a new game. Oh, the trees are doing all right there. Um. All right. I think maybe I've got too many gates. Or maybe not. I don't know. Does that want to be more garbage, more deliveries, more exports? I think we're just going to have them as doors. Do we need these road gates here? We do not. I'm going to demolish these road gates uh, on the sides. We just have the main ones because... Whoa, not that. Undemolish. Stop your demolishment. There we go. Uh, we'll dismantle these road gates. I don't think we're ever going to need road gates again. It's not, I, will, I could just dump them, but we'll dismantle them for now. You never know. Stick them in storage. That'll be fine. Might come up. This might go wrong. We might need them in the end. But that breaks them up nicely. So we'll get rid of that and then they'll just be garbage or whatever. Uh, we've got pr 15 prisoners coming in. Shit, do we have the room for 15 prisoners? 63 to 68. No! We do not. I we fucked that up. So, uh, four, five. We can have five prisoners, please. Just five. Soon, soon. 90 trillion! Actually, the game's getting a bit laggy now. <laughs> Getting a little, it's getting a little uh, fuzzy when I'm zoomed out. I suppose because there's just so much going on. Alright, uh, there's some bookshelves appearing now as well. It's nice. Come on, you guys. Come on, you pricks. Get the bookshelves in there. Well, effects aren't helping with her. I think it's still running at like fine levels. But I want to expand. Maybe I should just start escaping from it now. I mean, like, now it's like just. Sorry, just that was my builder train. Yeah, I mean, now it's. Oh, I can build anything now. 
I can be, I can make this look like fucking the, I don't know the Titanic. I have Titanic as a prison. No, there's no. I could have I could have everything everywhere. I don't have to worry about money or any of that jism. That's a good feeling. That's a good old feeling. Um, I don't know. What do we want to do with this series now? I feel like I don't know. Fuck. This is the problem that happens when you you find something out. I'm like, oh, the money's there. I could just build another prisony thing and then split stuff off, but it's kind of roughly so. I feel like this prison works. I think that's my thing, is that this prison works. Like, it, it just works. Everything's in the right place. There's enough people for it. I mean, we may run out of maximum security room. That may be, like, the only thing I need to extend. But this, this fucking prison works. I'll tell you what. This episode, we'll tart it up. We'll tidy it up. We'll sort it. We'll just clean the edges. We'll soften it up a bit. And then, next episode, we will play this prison in escape mode. So let's get this prison uh, absolutely sorted. I want that door locked open. Uh, <laughs> not for me. Uh, but I also want to have metal detectors here. And here. Yeah, so we're, we're prepping this for my own personal escape. Uh, I'd like an armory, because I want to make this difficult for myself. Any rooms we're not using yet? I think actually we used, end up using all of them. There's a power room here. Well, that's a power room with an armory. Um, armory. It's far away enough as well. It's tucked right back down here. That would be difficult to get to. But I might get to it if I can. Uh, so, weapon rack. We had a few of them, didn't we? One, two, three, four, five, six. Guard lockers. So we can have a few of them dodgy, scary guard blokes. I think they might just be just guard in this room. And then some tables for whatever it is they do with tables. I guess that's a secret armory I'm building in there. Do we want armed guards around the place? No, I'm going to try and roll out taser deployment. Uh, how much does that cost? 12 hours. That should be done by the end of the episode if we speed up through it. Deployment's unnecessary. Offshore tax haven. Eh, why not? Do you to work on lawyers? No, we're not going to have a lawyer. I don't want to move in place with a lawyer. Room access we're not going to need. Cool, let's get... Let's just, let's just polish this thing up. So we've got solitary here. We've got enough cells for it to not be an issue. Uh, we will stop taking prisoners in. I don't know if more prisoners will turn up and leave. I don't actually know. I tried that escape mode, I think, once. And I never actually worked out how to do it all. So that's going to be very much a learning curve. Very, very much a learning curve. Ah, but there's people making things. People making tables. Do we do all the grants except for cell block E? We could build another cell block. I think when I'm done with this series, I'm going to sell this prison. And I'm going to, uh... Build another, like, build a two a big twofer. Big fuck off twofer. <laughs> yeah, this feels like a good point. This feels like a good point when the prison, the prison's doing good. Man, nah, maybe you want to extend the kitchen. Ah, fuck. Let's actually. Let's get some more stuff in there. Too many cooks, etc. 70 guards seems good. We're going to get another 10 janitors. This is going to shine, motherfucker, shine. Workmen seem kind of unnecessary. Uh, doctors. I don't know, I'll have a third one. The new guy is like, hello, I'm the doctor. Uh, psychologists. Ooh, we can have more than one psychologist. Don't want one, but we can. Guards, workmen, armed guards, zero, zero. Dog handlers are fine. Gardeners, let's have a... Oop. Blocked, blocked. Oh, God, those trees are huge. Come on, stay on. I want ten gardeners as well. Ooh, auto save. There we go, ten gardeners. So we've left, we're leaving the prison in a nice money-making state. Oh, I want to finish off these rooms then. I would very much like to finish off these two, last two laundry rooms and set everything up properly. So yeah, by the end of this episode we just go, we're done! That's the priz. And then we have to live in the fucking thing. Uh, let's have a nice pool table. Uh... We can have a pool table and then have a whole bunch of chairs that just sort of face the pool table. So it's like the pool tournaments like that. Yeah, right. That looks like a nifty little thing. Uh, we can have some phone booths because apparently got some spare line around here. Uh, some TVs. Oh, nice wide sofas to stare at it. This is that. This is the TV room then. There we go. And then, well, that's the waiting for the sofa room then. TV. Yeah, ooh. Right way around, that way around, TV, TV, there we go, so the common rooms are done, they're all done, 
there's no blank rooms. There's the mail sorting room. CCTV monitor just it's got nothing to monitor, really. <laughs> I've got that. As long as I don't get put in a max sack, I should be fine. Oh, hello. Wow, look at you. So just swirly and everything. Uh, you've got a car room, you've got a classroom. There's nothing you're missing. What rooms have we not built? Shower. Dormitory. Holding cell. That's all fine for me. We can just activate the scale mode on a save file, can't we? Ah, if not, I'll burn the place to the ground and then do it. I think we can. Uh, this needed to be dismantled. I need to dismantle this gate. Oh, wait. Why the fuck isn't there a gate there? Why the fuck isn't there a gate there? Why the fuck isn't there a road gate there? Did I put it in the wrong place? I think I put it in the wrong place. Oh, shit. Uh, I'll extend out the exit. Do I want to extend out the export? So I just want to have a much bigger delivery bay. Delivery is a fucking huge as it is. I don't know. Oh, I'll tell you what I can do. I'm trying to stick down some fancy floor in, in certain places. Hang on, is it? Wooden floor looks nice. Walk speed, no, is there a walk speed? Fast! Concrete floor! I want all the yards to be quick off the draw. Oh, hang on, is this already? Is, this, is that already that stuff? No, oh, that's already concrete, isn't it? Oh, what's the point of any other thing? Wooden floor, it's cheap as well. It's fast. Paving stones. That's outside only, isn't it? Okay, well, we can have a nice sort of crisscrossy pattern. Oh my god, I never noticed that wasn't light up! Okay, we're not gonna have that. What about between here and here? Fuck my life! Right, so none of those things. Uh, ceramic floor, indoor only, metal floor. Oh, metal floor. Oh, there we go, we'll just change that up to a metal floor then. Just for no reason other than I can. Uh, that gives them something to do. Lots of workmen around the place, just being busy and shit. Right, we got. Can't really get through any of these doors. Metal detectors everywhere. I'm gonna make this fucking hard for myself. Because, uh. It has to be. We've got a metal detector there, but we don't have one there. Can we get the electricity over there in time? I don't know if anything that's not being built will actually be built in time. Uh, but I want a metal detector there. Like so. And I want another one to be. here. I'm going to set a guard off on that bit so we can't get down there. So there's going to be a guard deploying down here. And a guard deployed here. Uh, is there any room there isn't guards? Guard in the canteen, don't anyone in the kitchen. Don't anyone in the kitchen. Guard in the canteen. What are you? That's the canteen. Down in the kitchen. Kennels, etc. No. Okay, good. Good. You ain't getting shite out of here. That room still failed. I don't know why. You can still get to that room, right? Where are all my guards? Are they still fucking building this thing? No, nope, there's a big fence around it. So around that way, as much as we've extended it, there's now a big field of nothing. And there's a big spooky face. Ooh, hello, I am the big snow face. <gasps> I don't know either. Um, what the fuck are you even doing? Cook things? Oh, like, just eat You're doing everything. All right, you just do the things. They're all doing things. All right, we've got metal detected there. So you can't get through that way without being metal protected, or that way, or that way, or that way, or that way. We can go that way. Utilities. Electrical. Oh, no, you can't. Oh, you can actually you can get through there. There's a way through. And up there. Oh, no, that's metal protected. Uh, oh, no, that's all metal protected. Neat. Actually, hang on, wait, around there. Metal protected. Walk through here. No, metal protected. I, guess, I think that is a completely sealed off way. I'm going to always be male detected. I've got to be careful about that. Do I want to attach this with another door like that? Just another, just a quick extension to, you know, make sure that they can get up to that bit quicker. Well, there's no fucking reason to be up there. It's useful for some things, but not much. Woof, woof, woof to you too. Okay, this is getting there. I'm going to speed it up now because I want to get through the common room. There they go, there's some chairs coming in now. So they're getting through those car roomy bits. Everyone's off to eat. Don't think we have any problems here, apart from the odd snitch being murdered. Like, we get no, like, danger or anything now. They've got everything they need. Uh, possibly some heating for the maximum security guys. Uh, oh, it's fucking snowing, so if we're ever going to get any time for that, that's what we want. Uh, no, everything's fine except the yard. I think we, get, oh, we must have given them heat. Oh, that canteen's just a bit cool, but who cares? Actually, we can run a hot water pipe up there, couldn't we? There's the nearest boiler. There. 
Might make it. You never know. If not, we could always stick a boiler in the something. We always have a boiler in here, actually. Uh, boiler. Boiler that. So it's got a pipe. Squeaky. And electricity. Squeaky. And then hot water pipe can go flooding up here. Up to there. Actually, down to there. No, nope. you in the eyes. Over there. And then objects. Uh, radiator. To radiate heat. That's it. That's the max security done. There's the regular security done. No new prisoners are going to turn up. I could always feel it could pass and be like, yeah, loads of them. Field of 208. Next intake, zero. I've got 193. Oh, but I'm saying, hang on, if I have it just for those guys, it's not going to take any max security in, is it, if I feel capacity? <sighs> Prison may be working, but I'm a fucking idiot sometimes. Right! When this common rooms are all glued together and all these are plumbed up, and I can tell that they're all plumbed up, I think they're all plumbed up. That's missing an ironing board. This building saying was missing lots of things. Uh, workshop. Oh, the armory! Why the fuck is nobody building this armory? I'm finding that very strange that nobody wants to build this armory. Like, surely these are armory related things. Weapon ranks? Yeah, it's all here. Alright, well, when that's all been built, then we'll be uh, taken away to our new prison. Oh, look, we've got metal flooring here now. Some concrete lying around the place. <laughs> oh, fuck. Uh, yeah, metal flooring there for that little bit to add, I don't know, just Jesus. <laughs> to add Jesus? Yes. Uh,. One electrical thing there. Oh, it actually it sticks out there. Alright, so that's useless in every way. Ah, fuck it. I'll kill the damn thing. Making good money. Making good money even without the fucking... Fucking hack. Like a elite hacker that I am. Oh, that's one thing I want. I want a guard deployed in there. Because that's always been quite a darkened room. Do we want a guard marching through the offices? Yes, we do. I'm never good at fucking escape. Ha ha ha! Oh fuck! Um, I really, I'm, I don't know how to escape from this prison, apart from digging a hole. That's literally all I'll be able to have to do is dig a hole. But there's constant deployment. If I get, if I get my cell as one of these ones in the corner, which is likely because they're the empty ones, I'm fucked. Absolutely bumble fucked. Actually, we're max thing. How the fuck am I even gonna get in there? Won't even let me in the thing. Oh, fuck. Look at that cost coming through. Body armor! Body armor! Everybody's getting body armor. Everybody's getting... At least they're using this. Everybody's getting body armor. Nice. That cost me an absolute shit ton of money that I wasn't prepared for. Turn the last episode. In fact, there's no planning left to do, is there? I guess the last episode's of planning. Ah, oh, what a beautiful prison this is. Was. Never shall be. Yeah, it's all sorted. Right, I'm gonna work out how to escape from this fucking thing on the next exciting episode. Until then, I think my prison is done. Ah, oh, isn't it lovely? Apart from the drug and those cigarettes. The Nerd Cube! The Nerd Cube!